Hey folks, meteorologist Tyler Eliason here at MyFoxHurricane.com. Hope you're having a great week. Appreciate you checking in with us. Not much to speak of still across the Atlantic Basin. This has been a long stretch going back to early July with nothing. I mean, I mean, tropical waves occasionally, but nothing that is any signs of any further development, which is great news. But you got to take that with a grain of salt. Remember, we're in July. June and July are typically pretty quiet months of the hurricane season. And it says nothing about how the rest of the season is going to play out. It may certainly end up being an above average season when all is said and done a couple of months from now. So you just kind of got to stay on guard as we head into August and September. Things really do start to ramp up quickly on average, at least not to say that's going to happen this year, but there are some signs that the environment across the Atlantic Basin will be better for development as we get into mid to late August and early September namely a stronger La Nina setting up for the third fall in a row. Kind of unusual to have three straight falls and three straight peak hurricane seasons uh, with a strong La Nina. La Nina, of course, kind of lends itself to more active than normal stretches in the Atlantic because typically it will lower wind shear uh, as a whole, which is a good thing for storm development. Uh, we'll see how it plays out, but again, that's kind of where we're headed right now. A couple tropical waves in the middle of the Atlantic. This one a little bit more robust, but there's a ton of dry air. It remains to be a ton of dry air all across this area. Saharan air layer, a lot of dust uh, kind of inhibiting any storm development there. It just chokes off storms. There's been pockets of higher wind shear, and at times in the central Atlantic here, even some lower than normal sea surface temperatures. So uh, again, up until this point, it's been fairly quiet for numerous reasons, but some signs that may change in the coming weeks. For now, things are quiet, so we just sit back, relax. We always have that plan, right? Because you want to have the plan to be ready and you can enact it within a few days if you need to if things happen quickly. You don't want to be that person racing to the store last second, trying to get everything you need, trying to get your plans in order with your family. So just have the plan in place. If you don't need it, great. If you need it, then you're already set and ready to go. So for now, rest easy, take care. Uh, enjoy the rest of your week.